living is I'm chair of the English department at the University of Texas. And I too am a professor of English at the University of Texas. Um, Liz is and is not my boss. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I love to watch movies, go to the theatre, I like to cook, and so the kitchen in this house is going to be probably the, massively the most expensive room. Well, I think kitchens are always the most expensive room. And the focal point. And the focal point, yeah. Um, so I love to cook. Uh, reading is what I got into my profession to do, and reading I still do a huge amount of, so I love to read. Not only do we have bookshelf books all over this house, especially upstairs where we have a makeshift study, um, but we both have offices in the university that are full of books and we cannot keep those offices when we retire. So we have a study that has bookcases, we have bookcases built in the hall, we have bookcases in both the bedrooms. <coughs> people were always saying, well, what about the people who come after you? Are they really going to want a house that's full of bookshelves? And I thought, I don't care who comes after me. They'll have to deal with the bookshelves. This is my house. This is me. And we don't want to throw away a lot of books. The most alarming thing that we're doing is leaving for 10 months. Uh, I mean that the story is we've been here for 30 years and we haven't done a lot to the house. Just the kitchen. And it's now falling down around our ears. And so it's a sort of exciting moment of actually living the way I would like to live. Potential. Potential. We're, not, we're a year away from that. We're a year away from yeah. that. Yeah. But we're trusting native. Yeah, we are. Tremendously. We are. We're putting ourselves in native's hands. got on my nerves, I would say to Alan, we're going to have a very large house, it's okay. And it looked the way it looks, it's... Um... It was gorgeous. We walked in here and it was a magic, absolutely magic. The idea of the kitchen as the heart of the house, really, in this big room is very important to me. But I, it, there, it's a tie with the bathroom and the walk-in closet. I mean, we had a bathroom that was five by six. I swear, it was awful. Was it that big? Uh, it was so small. The flow, I believe it's called the, the flow. flow. That was Jackie's term. The flow in that side of the house is perfect. Absolutely perfect. The laundry room! <laughs> Which she has fallen in love with I've despite herself. I fell in love with the laundry room and I wasn't in the least bit interested in laundry. Everybody asks us, you left the country and you trusted your builder? Mm. And they look at you as though you had actually taken leave of your senses. Um, because nobody trusts their builder. And we said, well, yeah, we did trust our builder. They were always explaining what was right, well, telling us how to do things, telling us why certain things cost what they did. Everything was explained. Being in that, being in that project together was what made us trust Native. And yes, we would absolutely recommend uh, like I've said to you before, the idea that anyone would build a house without making it um, eco-friendly is insane, it seems, in Texas, with all this sunshine. <laughs> 